Welcome back, everyone, to Let's Play Quest for Glory 5 Dragonfire. It's been a while, I know. I'm IG Matthew. When we last left off, uh, we had homunculi issues, I believe. Um, I've lowered some of the volumes a little bit. Hopefully you can hear me better now. I'm also trying to speak up a little. It's against my nature, but uh, I'll try. Alright, well, let's not waste any time. Let's kill some homunculi and survive. Let me get some more chainmail. Oh, I also found out how to get the Pegasus Feather. I was looking it up. I looked it up because far too lazy to figure it out, of course. Um, so we'll be getting those too, and I'll go back for some amphora because I forgot them again. All right, let's get started. I'm running away because there's a lot of them. No. Yeah, I'm gonna die. That's one down. Oh. Da, 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 da. Stop killing me. Stop it. Another down. I'm out of a mana again. See, this is why we bought so many mana potions. Because I need mana. Horribly. There's one left. I don't know where he is. And I'm dying from exhaustion. So we'll just grab the basket and run. Do 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 do. Oh, there he is. Well, he's nice and glitched, so. We'll just, uh, run for our dear lives. Alright. Back! Back to Samaria! That way it's blocked. Oh, pff, Bats. Why'd it have to be bats? I'd rather snakes! Snakes don't fly around, they're easier to hit. I desperately need... Be nice if we had like a create food spell. Nom. Mm. It's not gonna be very helpful. Cause I'm lazy. Well, let's go to bed. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Go to bed. And we'll sleep until morning. So, how is everyone doing? I've been great. I'm hungry. So, we'll go down and have another lovely meal from No Man. Now, I found out um, why I thought earlier that No Man had more conversational topics. It hit me while I was driving. Not literally. Um, if you talk to her before you go get the, your key, uh, she'll have more topics. So, in a future video, I will just show a quick video talking to her. We're having goulash. You don't want to know. You really don't want to know. Mmm, goulash. Surprisingly, I've tasted worse. I'm sure I've bit the floor a few times, so I'm sure the ground tastes worse than the goulash, right? Right? Regardless. Let's go give Sarah her basket. And let's buy some M4 before I forget again. Oh, really cool side note. Just because. Where is it? Detect magic. Your status as a hero makes you magical. Let me get a little closer. Now, why would there just be something leading down here? Who knows? I know. But, nah. Thought it glowed magical. Oh well. 
This seemingly inconspicuous wall will become important later. Remember its existence. It's a giant concrete slab. I don't know how you could forget it. Let's talk to Wolfie. Namaste, and may you be having a pleasant day. And we'll purchase Amphora. Like I said earlier, we want about ten of these because I don't remember how many we need. Um, that is a very good offer, but it is not enough for me to accept. Perhaps you'll... Now we seem to be getting very good, very good. This is very, very good. We have made an agreement which we both agree upon. Yeah, I'm more dull with it, but... Oh well, I have my Amphora. I will stop forgetting them now. Greetings, wanderer from afar. Welcome to the sea sands and shores of Silmaria. I am Sara, a cotta merchant of jewelry and gifts. How may I aid you on your journey? Let's talk to her. We haven't talked to her yet, so this will be our first time. Yeah, yeah, I know. Another video talking to merchants. Bear with welcome it. again, and thrice more welcome. You have the manners of one who earns the respect of all around you. We are the children of the desert sands, traders and merchants to a thousand lands. My mate, Marak the food seller, and my daughter, Sala, the maker of music, have come to this land of water and waves to make our fortune. My life mate, Marak, sells food from a cart. He is on the other side of this plaza. Sala is still but a kitten. But she has talent and the will to become a highly skilled musician some day. Perhaps soon she will be invited to perform somewhere other than the streets of Silmaria. However, she is shy and doesn't speak except with her music. Which is very good music. I am the seller of jewelry and baubles to please the eye and enhance the beauty of the wearer. I am most well, kind sir. I hope that I may be of service to you always. This is a beautiful city, although there is too much water for the desert fur of Akata. This is the town square, where the merchants have shops and stands. There is word said that a hero has been summoned to this land to drive away the invaders and restore the peace of Silmaria. That's us. The countryside has been overwhelmed with an army of outsiders. The city may be attacked at any time. That is why this city is so empty. Most of the people and visitors have gone elsewhere. So, you are the Prince of Shapir. You are a great hero of our homeland. I am most honored to speak with you, Kata friend. Yay, we're friends. May you find in this land the heart's content which you seek. All right, let's give her her basket. Temporarily replace that. Basket. My basket. Oh, thank you. I had given up upon ever seeing it again. It was made by my grandmother, and it was given to me when I was still a kitten. I cannot thank you enough for this. Here is the reward of which I wrote in my notice at the Adventurer's Guild. The small. I know it is not much of a reward, but it is a token of my eternal friendship. Thank you again. Awesome! We have beaded necklace. We could sell it right back to her, but since we have nothing better to do with it, we'll wear it. Because we can. And our mana pills go back there. Because I really don't need to be equipping and unequipping beaded necklaces in any sort of hurry. Alright, we've got everything we need. Alright. Um, but we still need more stuff. We need stuff, lots and lots of stuff. Um, ah. All right, we're gonna go finally talk to one of the more interesting characters. Yes, there are more interesting characters on this island. Uh, he is the famous adventurer. He's a man of many names, many skills, many talents. He will teach us how to swim. Well, he will give us a book on how to swim. Or we will steal the book on how to swim. 
In any case, we will learn to swim from here. And I'm almost out of time. So, when we come back, we will go into the Famous Adventurer's Guild house. We will talk to him. Yes, I know. More talking. Blah. I want to see you in combat, failing at spells! No. We must talk to people. Because talking to people is good. These are rocks. You can pick up these rocks. I don't need rocks. I have force bolt. Regardless, I'm babbling on. I will see you in a moment. Till then. <laughs>